eyes that this actually happened. Mm, got it. Because on the out, like the basic, like the moral of the story is like Hannah Baker's this, you know, fun, like nobody thinks anything's wrong. Mm -hmm. And then all of these things are happening behind the scenes that nobody else sees. You know what I mean? Yeah. Hmm. Gotcha. <sighs> I like well, it. Cool. Well, unfortunately, I have an event at 7.30 in a few minutes. So okay, I so have to go. Snap. Well, thank this you was for so being, much fun. Yeah, thank you for being my impromptu guest. Absolutely. I hope this was interesting. Like, Anytime. This was really fun. And the Anytime. roles switched. You interviewed me instead. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it was fun. Oh, yeah. So I guess we're going to play some commercials, and I'll come back after this with another guest. So bye, guys. Thanks, Israel. Bye. Bye. Absolutely. guys, welcome back to Slate Me. I'm your host, Samantha here. And for this interview, we have an award-winning author that I'm really excited to introduce to y'all. So I guess we'll just jump right in. Hello, can you hear me? Hi, Samantha. How are you? I can hear you. Welcome. Thank you for being on the show today. First of all, uh, you're most welcome. First of all, I thank you for having me on the show. It's really an honor to be on your show. Thank, Thank you so much. You. Thank you. So I guess we'll just jump right into the questions. Sure, please go ahead. Um, my first question for you is, when did you first realize that you wanted to be an author? Uh, Samantha, I've, all, uh, I've always said that uh, I'm an author by choice, not by profession. But uh, it just uh, happened. Uh, my first book, The Strange Loyalist, inspired by true events, uh, was based upon uh, real life places and events, and it was a true story. So that's how things started for me. And from there onwards, I moved on. I wrote my second book and things went well. And that's how it all happened. Awesome. Yeah, that's really good to hear. So my second question for you is, um, you're an award-winning author. So which books and what awards have you won? Like, tell us about that. Uh, Sammy, I'm an international, alhamdulillah, I'm an international award-winning author. Uh, my book, Wrinkles, actually uh, won the Reader's Favorite International Book Award contest uh, held in USA in 2016. Uh, let me tell you, this is the same uh, book award contest uh, uh, that was won by 
uh, Hollywood superstar Jim Carrey, uh, Jim Carrey in 2014. Uh, having said that, uh, uh, my book Once uh, was also uh, an award finalist in, in the 2013 contest. Awesome. Congratulations on that. Thank you so much. Thank you. So you mentioned you have a book called Wrinkles, which I have read and loved personally, which it's it's a love story, but it's not a traditional love story. It has a, a bit of a twist at the end. How did you come up with that concept? Well, uh, it's about uh, writing not just a book, but uh, writing meaningful fiction. Uh, all mm-hmm. of this intent to write a book that not only entertains, but also enlightens. And uh, I want to create it in the form of a package. I don't want that if some of my read that a reader if a reader spends his money and buys my book, I want them to get something out of it. So mm-hmm. it's not about just a story. I also intend that it should be a meaningful story that that is realistic, because I don't believe that people have time to read uh, fairy tales nowadays. That's how I assume. So I want to write a story that people can relate to. So mm-hmm. it's a meaningful fiction. It's a meaningful book. You get entertainment out of it, but having said that, you also get a message out of the book. Apart from that, what what makes my book different from others is that uh, when when in, in movies like you have custom songs, in my mm-hmm. books you have tailor made poetry. Uh, mm-hmm. I want readers to get something out of it, a story, or they take a good poetry from the book, a custom yeah. poetry. They might keep it with them. They might use it. They might like it. They might share it with one another. Uh, or, 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 or they can even learn a new la- a new word from English language and and <laughs> enhance their vocabulary. So something something I want to give out of uh, something is there for everyone. So that's how I actually intend to create a product that itself is a complete package. And I strongly believe having a marketing experience that uh, being a marketing specialist that nowadays people are more inclined to buy packages. So mm-hmm. that's how I actually intend to create a package, be it once, be it uh, the strange loyalist, be it victim of shame or be it wrinkles. Uh, mm-hmm. I always intend to write a book uh, that not only entertains, but it also enlightens. That's amazing. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you so much. So you have a book called Missing. Do you want to tell us about that? Well, definitely. Why not? Uh, that is something one of the most highly anticipated books I have so far worked on. And uh, nowadays, everyone actually asks me one thing that uh, when missing will come out, mm-hmm. uh, that is the most uh, uh, that is what people always ask me. And I just want to let you know over here that uh, Alhamdulillah, a uh, US publishing house Wild Blue Press has signed a three book deal with me. Mm. And, uh, and 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 just a couple of days back, uh, uh, I also received an email. My publisher asking me that when missing is gonna come out, <laughs> and uh, I'm just working. I'm just working on it. And uh, initially, it was inclined. It was intended to be released worldwide in some uh, uh, somewhere in 2017, but due to unforeseen reasons, the book had to got delayed. Uh, but I always believe what happens happens for the best, and. Uh, uh, I uh, and I had to uh, and later on I was uh, signed by Wild Blue Press for a three book deal and now uh, officially it will be published by uh, Wild Blue Press inshallah uh, it will be coming out uh, somewhere in 2018 uh, but most probably I will try my best to get it done uh, by June 2018 Missing is a, a suspense thriller mm-hmm. uh, it is set into four different countries it is based upon the real life relationship of uh, two uh, two people um it's based upon a real life relationship uh, it, it also uh, has uh, it, it 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 also ha- it is uh, it also has a great twist uh, to the storyline uh, and uh, and, and, it, and it's ed- edge of a seat thriller uh, it's edge of a seat thriller that that is something that people will definitely love and uh, uh, I'm, I'm sure that the way the trail, the teaser trailer of the book has built up the hype, uh, mm-hmm. the book itself will also live up to the standards, will live up to the mark, and uh, it will it, it will justify the brand of books that I write. Uh, after Victim of Shame, this uh, this is this is gonna be my. Uh, I won't I won't say that after Victim of Shame that won't be right because th- uh, it is indeed a suspense thriller, but it ha- it has its own. Uh, aura it has its own significance it has its own flavor so mm-hmm. um, it is set into four different countries 
and uh, the way storyline the plot of the book actually revolves uh, is something really fascinating it is it is about uh, uh, zia uh, aka uh, z uh, and uh, lena volikova it's a story about these two people and i want to let you know that uh, uh, this is also uh, the, 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 the 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 male protagonist of the book his name is actually based upon uh, the name of my father uh, i actually i actually like uh, my surname my father zia he's actually a hero for me and uh, uh, when i had to think about the name of the male protagonist i i, I decided to go with the uh, with my father's name uh, so that's what i can tell you uh, at this point of time about the book uh, without even disclosing any further things i'm really looking forward to reading it thank you so much and yes uh, indeed there is no doubt about it that uh, after the teaser trailer was launched uh, it was so much liked but everyone uh, around the world i really feel deep, uh, i really feel deeply humbled deeply neat it has to my humility to see the great response the teaser trailer of the book received and uh, i have received uh, emails messages mm -hmm. even from big names uh, big authors from united states of america even from american actors including yourself that uh, <laughs> they have shown their great interest in interest in reading uh, missing and asking me that when it's going to come out but it will come out soon i'm sure inshallah awesome so i've heard that this mo this book that you're writing you're thinking about turning it into a movie correct well all my books are intended and written in a way that they can be transformed uh, or adapted into a movie uh, let me tell you that one of my books uh, once uh, ask me nothing not love uh, it was also translated into russian and once is already recommended to be a hollywood movie as well so 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 yes there is no doubt about it i hope that uh, missing also uh, 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 is also adapted into a movie and it and it has that potential that it can be so let's see how the future unfolds and what happens next you never know when the good times come so mm -hmm. so let's see what happens next Awesome. So I'm being informed that we actually have the trailer for Missing. So we're going to take a small break and we're going to show the trailer and we'll come back to the interview. Sure, please. And we're back. So you want to tell us, um, is there anything else you want to share with us before we have to wrap up this interview? We'll both do well. Burn together in hell. <laughs> Ooh, mind of a poet. <laughs> well, uh, uh, actually, uh, let's see that. Uh, uh, let's see how the book uh, 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 how the book does. Uh, but I'm sure that it will do well. Uh, and uh, I'm. Uh, I just uh, want to again thank you for having me on your show. It was a pleasure, and uh, uh, I just uh, I just want to let you know that uh, all, all my readers around the world and uh, all the people who read my book, who support me, who like my work, uh, beat anyone in any part of the world. That I, I really thank all of you uh, for being so kind uh, and for uh, sharing your reviews. Your, re your your reviews and star ratings are very important to me. So all the people around the world who, who read my books, uh, I, I thank them and I just request them that uh, to share their feedback, to share their star ratings for me. It helps me to get motivated and to do better and better. And mm -hmm. I'll try my best to come up with even more 
uh, better books and uh, that live up to the expectations and you love my books. Thank you so much. Thank you for being on the show today. I really enjoyed your interview and I'm really looking forward to reading your new book. Thank you so much. Uh, it was a pleasure. Thank you so much. Thank you. And I will see you all guys right after a short commercial break and I'll be back with my next guests.